Hey everyone, how we doing? I was here yesterday for the first time. It looks like the perfect lake for me to fish. All overhanging trees, lots of uh, lay downs, and I said, I'm gonna kill the bass in this lake. So I came down here yesterday. Next thing you know, I see a fish jump. It was a mullet. And I'm like, wait a minute here. Then all of a sudden I see tarpon rolling. Tarpon. It's tarpon. There's tarpon in here. Got the wrong tackle box. No idea this was salt water. This isn't just a lake. There is a stream back there that connects it to a saltwater creek. So this is brackish water. And there are juvenile tarpon. I saw them yesterday rolling anywhere from 5 up to 25 pounds it looked like. But you never know. There could be a 40, 50 pounder lurking around in here. You have no idea really. So yesterday, all I had was my bass gear, and I still wound up uh, getting bit. God, there he is. Got him. For another jump. <sighs> but they're extremely hard to catch. Their mouths are extremely hard, so you have to have a really, really hard hook set. They do gyrating backflips, so they know how to get the hook out. They're just extremely hard to land, and they're very, very finicky on what they eat. I brought an assortment of artificial baits today, but it's first light right now. Pretty soon, we're going to start seeing these tarpon rolling on the surface. So let's see what we can do today. Beauty. comes. <sighs> Hard fish to grab. <laughs>
perfect. Yeah. 30, 36 inches. Well, here we go. My first tarpon in the ultra skiff and he is an absolute beauty. Got him on the egret baits voodoo mullet there. You can see we got a nice hook set. There we go. Let's get a nice release here. Here he goes. He's ready. There he goes. All right. Well, that was awesome. Well, that was great. That was my first tarpon I've ever landed in the ultra skiff. Certainly glad I came out today to do this. Good story. See if I can get another one. If I do, I do. If I don't, I don't. Either way, thanks for watching. Tight lines.